a head for thinking, eyes for seeing, ears for hearing, a mouth to talk and eat with, hands for playing, a pee pee for making wee wee, legs for walking and running, and a bottom for sitting. And a little hole for making poo poo. If somebody wants to talk with the shit with me, I don't want. I I won't do it. 똥 눈다는 것이 그렇게 어떻게 그 개인적으로 아주 퍼스널하게 뒤에서 숨겨져야 하는 그 모든 퍼블릭 섹터에서 예 나오지 말아야 되는 그런 거 아니라고 생각하는 거죠. Well, it's an uncomfortable topic to talk about. 예, 똥이라는 것이 똥 눈다는 것이. 그냥 그냥 간단한 문제가 아니고. Well, I have no problem with that. But we take our vegetables, our meat, our normal uh, kind of uh, input. We eat it. We get the energy. We make the wonderfully ordered system that is us. And as a result, we have to create to balance this a very disorderly system is the waste. Uh, Kurochakman 그 물로 버려지기 때문에 물이 오염이 되고 땅은 사람 배설물이 땅으로 돌아가지 못하기 때문에 그 순환 고리가 끊어지기 때문에 땅은 척박해져서 또 비료를 써야 되고 또 농약을 써야 되고 이렇게 되는 이중으로 물과 땅이 한꺼번에 다 오염이 되는 이런 구조에 있거든요. 그래서 이 모든 사람이 똥눌 때마다 아내 똥의 운명이 어떻게 되는가 여기에는 어느 누구도 예외가 있어. 대각관에도 수세식 화장실이 있다. 배설물이 다시 땅으로만 돌아가면은 그러면 그두 가지 문제가 모두 다 해결이 된다고 보는 겁니다. 250 Right, so the first thing when you come into here is to okay. take a deep breath in. Does it smell? Not really, but honestly... Just, it's hard only yeah, touch a touch of smell. Yeah. Okay, if they're properly designed, compost toilets don't actually need to smell. Okay. So they can actually smell less than, oh, right, yeah. than your, you know, 
than your normal toilet at home does. Mm -hmm. One of the interesting things about this compost toilet is it's actually got a, a urine separator in it. The urine is very, it's very wet mm -hmm. and it makes the whole composting process mm -hmm. go quite slowly mm -hmm. and quite, it goes quite anaerobic and smelly. Because urine is actually very similar to NPK fertiliser. It's very, very rich in nitrogen, phosphorus and potassium. And um, if you just collect that and water it down 10 to 1 or 15 to 1 and use it on your garden, it's, it's just as good as buying fertiliser. This is, what, um, this is what human sewage looks like when it's been composted. All right. So yeah. um, if you just have a little smell of that. Nothing. Just nothing. Like just, so, yeah. just smells like soil yeah. because it is soil. That's, is. What, that's what soil's made from, really, isn't it? Is breakdown of organic material. But well, basically, I touched that one now, yeah? But yeah. it's the soil. Yeah, it's soil now. <laughs> You know, yeah. all organic material goes through the carbon cycle and so leaves fall off trees and become leaf litter on the ground. That then starts composting, it turns into soil. It's the same, with, same thing with sewage, it's the same thing with animal droppings, okay. it's the same, it was the same thing with dinosaur droppings, caveman <laughs> droppings, you know, everything. <laughs> uh -huh. There's a couple of percent of people that aren't on main sewage, but most of those will actually have um, some kind of flush toilet system and we'll have a septic tank and a leach field. Far fewer people actually have compost toilets at home in the UK. About the compost toilet, yeah. well, very interesting. It's a little bit smelly. Yeah. <laughs> like if the government or whatever mm. recommends the people to use the compost toilet, would you like to use it in the, maybe in the near future? In the near future, say, not in my house. Sujeshik. 화장실이 환경을 오염하는 오염원이다라고 생각이 되면 오염원을 제거를 해야 된단 말이에요. The introduction of closed sewer systems has dramatically increased the health of the population and the life expectancy of the population. And I think the flush toilet has been a major part of that whole concept that has been put in place that if you look at the flush toilet, you can actually call it an environmentally idiotic technology. It takes a little bit of human excreta, it takes a lot of clean water, and then it uses water, clean water, as its, as its main um, um, uh, form of um, um, discharge. And then, if you're not able to clean it up, you also then use water, which is rivers and lakes, at the, as the point at which you dilute it. Well, most flush toilet systems use a lot more water than they need to. Mm -hmm. um, your normal toilet at home often flushes with about 10 litres of water. Mm -hmm. uh, it's actually possible to get a toilet that flushes with two, maybe three litres of water. Uh, Africa, Kenya, Tanzania, Masai Jogisan, Dong Africa, Sudan, Mokurun, Nuer Joksan, Kurun Chokorogamun, Hanjibe, Chilpalmeng is Hanun Jibe, Achime, Hambon Nagas, Moa on Muri, Orita Baki and then the Marge. Orita Mulo, Chilpalmengi, Masia then and Kumurin there, Nega Tongambon Nugo, Shimita Murigan Naganda. Egonan. 죄악이란 말이지. 수세식으로 가지 말고 이게 건식으로 가야 되는데. That a dry sanitation is not inferior. It is actually superior. It's superior because it costs less, it uses less water and doesn't pollute the environment. So we have to we have to persuade the world that it's superior. 이런 게 지금 인도에서는 지금 실천이 되고 있거든. in the name of Sulab Shaujalia. This is a hand flush compost toilet. This is a two pit pour flush toilet. In the system, there are two pits. These pits are alternately used. When one pit is used, excreta is diverted to second pit. 
So by the time second pit filled in, the contents of the first pit, I mean human excreta of first pit, turns into pathogen free, odorless, solid manure that is taken out easily by the beneficiary and used for agriculture purposes. This is an individual toilet yes. used in the household. Right, household. <coughs> yeah, house. Now this is converted into man. This is fertilizer. Yeah. This is, this is the fertilizer of excreta. Oh, right. No problem, okay. because it is after sun, um, sun drying. Okay. It is up to 99.9% .9 pathogen free. All right. And it is very good manure. All right. And it can be used as a fertilizer. Cost of the system is very low in comparison to other systems. It depends upon the materials of used for construction of pits and the superstructure and size of the pits. It means it is suitable for all, the poor, the middle class and the rich class people. The model first one, it is a $10. So these are the different materials used for superstructure. One is a gunny bag, then thatch, then like this. In this case, it is 20 years of each pit. The cleaning interval will be for 40 years. If one constructs it in the middle age, his or her um, children will have to clean it. The requirement of water is just 2 liters. Now what happens? This much amount of water is always present in the trap. That's why there is a never backflow of smell and it is very light and it is very cheaper. The sewer system, it was introduced in India in 1870, in New York in 1860, in London 1850. And if you see, after 133 years in India, out of 5,000 smaller big towns, only 232 are sewer based. So this system is more suitable, so far, so far environmental aspect is concerned, is more suitable than septic tank system and other systems. 20 seated toilet. Ah. Yeah. Uh, right? yeah. And uh, about 2,000 users per day use in this toilet. Oh, right. yeah. This gas can be um, taken in gas holders and from gas holders to be used in different purposes. Yeah, yeah this is pipe. Yeah. 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 From yeah. Yeah. Now the gas is used. No smelling. This is from biogas. It is equivalent to 60 watt. This is a dual fuel engine. It runs on diesel as well as on biogas. Initially, it starts on diesel, but when biogas is injected through this pipe, then diesel consumption is reduced by 80%. Only 20% diesel is required, rest is biogas. Where it will start, this biogas will flow there. They think that it is a it is a human excreta. That uh, that uh, gap of knowledge is has to be filled in. You can take one piece. It, it is tasty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. It is hot, perhaps. Okay. It is hot. Okay. Not hot. Uh -huh. huh? Delicious. Delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, 
uh, and I'm told that the plant is now up and running. Mm -hmm. How efficient it is, I don't know. The first uh, anaerobic digestion plant in the UK which collects from 20 farms. We produce green electricity. We uh, burn the methane, which would be produced by the material, by the by the, the cow slurry, oh. and and eventually we hope to heat Holsworthy with the spare hot water that we have from the generators. All right. We have enough electricity, maybe for. 1,500 houses, up to, up to 2,000 houses, something like this. So these are 4,000 4, cubic metres each. So we have 8,000 cubic metres of shit. Or dung, sorry. <laughs> each generator has an output of 1,050 kilowatts. And then the hot water produced from this will then be sent into Holsworthy to heat the town. People worry, yeah, you know, know, yeah. and but these these towers are constructed of of sheets. You know, it's it's people have uh, some strange ideas sometimes. Everybody knows that we need these kind of things, but mm -hmm. not this town. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Um, in in, in in English, we have this uh, expression "nimby." Nimby. Which, yes, which is not in my backyard. Okay. Um, it is a good idea, but not here. All right. Okay. Um, yes, uh, <laughs> and, and to be honest, would I would I like to live right next to a plant like this? Um, I, I would have to say, to be honest, I would say no. Okay. And this. <laughs> Next week, this big. I, I think the farmers were um, a little bit unsure when we first started the project, but I, I think now we are com we are proving that there are uh, beneficial properties in the biofertilizer. They, um, I think maybe the problem now is we have too much, too good. In America, people use about 400 litres of water <laughs> per person per day yeah. in their homes. Mm -hmm. That is about 1,200 cans of fizzy drink. That's how much water they use. Okay. And it's completely unnecessary. In America, they use 400 litres. In the UK, we use 100 litres. Mm -hmm. And in parts of Scandinavia, they use less than. They, they use about 100 litres. We use maybe 150. Mm -hmm. In developing nations, they're lucky to get 10 litres per person per day, mm -hmm. and that may well not be clean. How fair is that? Water is local, and, and the local conditions have got to suit the local circumstances. So it's got to be affordable. Mm -hmm. There has to be the water resources available, and in many countries there isn't. And so there isn't just enough water available for doing what's happened in the Northern Hemisphere. Yeah. So I don't think that argument applies to water. 환경이라는 걸 놓고 이게 한국 환경이 따로 있고 미국 환경이 따로 있고 중국 환경이 따로 있고 일본 환경이 따로 있는 게 아니거든. 이거는 지구 전체의 하나의 시스템 속에 하나의 에코시스템 되고 있는 거라 말이죠. 그러니까 and and we don't have issues like that. Some of the developing countries where sanitation system is is uh, not as developed as in the developed countries. It is also for the developed nations. Because now those countries are also facing the acute problem of water. We have good sewage treatment, so pollution is no longer a problem, not in, not in our country. This is the problem of the scale of the scale. It's a problem of the scale. The scale is very important. We have to use it. 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 System problem. 
아, 많은 사람들이 여기에 문제의식을 느끼고 있는 사람이 하고 싶어도 못하는 힘들지 않을까? 그런 게좀 개발이 돼 있어? 처럼 어떤 매스 프로덕션, 인더스트리얼리제이션, 뭐 어버니제이션 뭐 이런 이 사회 현상에서는 개인이 어떻게 할 수가 없어. 60,000 employees around the world. 저희가 지금 전 세계적으로 지금 42개 공장을 가지고 있고요. 그러니까 아, 똥을 누는 내가 똥을 누는데 수직 변기에 똥을 누는다. 수직 변기도 아메리칸 스탠다드에서 만든 거다. 일본에서 만든 토토에서 만든 거다. 그게 지금 우리 여기서도 수입해가 쓰고 아니면은 여기서 만들더라도 그 로열티 주고 여기서 만들어서 쓰고 그런 기본적인 마인드가 있어요. 아, 사람들이 생각할 때이 제품은 미국에서 바로 수입이 된 수입품이라는 이미지하고 그렇죠. 한국에 공장이 있어요. 스탠다드 공장이 또 국산에도 있다고요. 한국에서 제작을 해요. 스탠다드를. 변기 같은 경우 이제 타일랜드에서 OEM으로 만든 걸 수입을 하는 거죠. 그럼 결국은 제국주의라도 어떤 뭐 문화 제국주의라고 할까? OEM 게 이제 좀 싸니까 OEM 방식으로 쓰죠. As a company, our role, I believe it is, to provide products that address the demands in these different environments. So you will find from American standards, just like you will find a flush toilet here in the United States, or you will find that in Japan, or you will find that in Europe, you will find, on the other hand, in a number of areas around the world that we sell what they call squat toilets, some even without a flushing system. Because that is what the market there requires. 개인적으로 내가 똥을 누는 것까지도 사실은 내 마음대로 할 수. Essentially, still being extremely dominated by the more powerful in the world, they have gone against the interests of the poor, and it is for that reason that you are not getting any sense of cooperation. You are not getting a sense that we all live in one earth and how will we share its resources. 하지 말아야 되는 거야. 그게 자본주의를 제대로 실천하는 방식이라. Oh, 이 화장실은 사실은 어, 폐자재를 이용한 화장실이에요. 그래서 어, 도시에서 폐, 폐 건축자재 그러니까 주워와 가지고 어, 만들었는데 뭐, 비용은 안 들었다고 봐야죠. 어. 또한 가지는 이제 화장실 안에서 어떤 그 편함. 그러니까 어, 밖의 전망을 볼수 있다든지 또 자연 안에서, 안에서 그튄 공간에서 어, 그 뒤, 그 대소변을 볼수 있다는 것 자체. 그게 이제 편하니까 그래서 이제 좋은 점, 장점이죠. 뭐, 이런, 이런 최, 최, 최소인데. 벌레도 많이 받고 타밭을 좀 볼까요? 여기에 다다 이제 그런 그런 
이건 이제 좀 달라요. 일반 이렇게 뭐 이렇게 하여튼 일단은 가, 가장 강한 게 병에 강해요. 병. 화학 비료는 비만을 기준 사람으로 말하면 비만을 주장하는 건데 이건 그, 그 튼튼하고 건강을 생각한다고. 그러니까, 그러니까 땅 자체가 걸음져 있는 것과 위에서 화학적인 성분을 뿌려서 이큰 작물하고는 많은 차이가 있어요. 한 인간이 태어나서 태어나서 일단 이제 흙에서 태어나 가지고 흙을 만지고 또 흙을 접하고 그리고 또 흙으로 돌아가야 되는 것이 이제 인간의 삶인데 일단 이제 그런 모습을 요즘 많이 이제 잊어져 가잖아요. 사람들이 살아가는 모습이 될수 있으면은 자연과 멀리하고 흙을 멀리하고 어, 흙 위에다가 어, 시멘트, 뭐 콘크리트 이런 걸 깔아가지고 멀리하려고 하는 것이 이제 그 편리함으로 생각하는 그 자체가 스스로를 이제 그 파멸을 길러가는 인간의 가장 이제 잘못된 행위지 않을까 이런 생각을 해요. If hago, tong nun nun ke hang mun hago, if sura wa hang mun hago manja wa minun, pibu jo jik toka chi dei seyo, pibu jo jik toka te, toka teng kuja, hana i terung ro yeng jiri dei seyo, babi dure ka nun kokwa, tong i na wunung kokwa, toka ki te mune, babi dure ka nun ke il mang ke tong nun nun il do koma ke m chung nyo hada. We're never going to because we have all our systems in place. Too late to change. Too late. Too late. I'm not sure I understand what you're talking about. Saying a flush toilet company would be responsible for the environment or for pollution. Well, I think the flush toilet system, you know, has a long history. It is very clear that the customers, the end users, like that as a product. I believe it has a long future in front of itself. Mm -hmm. uh, America, in particular, have incredibly inefficient toilet systems. Okay. They have a real um, paranoia about flushing the toilet. 지구의 그 자연의 입장에서 산이나 강의 입장에서 보면 아마 사람이라는 종이 가장 위태로운 적일 겁니다. 사람이 그만큼 하여간 지구에서 지구 자체가 보면 사람이 암이죠 암. 사실은 우리 정신 문제는 편리에 중독된 예, 지난 5, 600년 동안에 예, 소위 시빌리제이션으로 인해서 만들어진 그 편리, 익스피디언스 거기에 중독이 된 결과가 결국 환경 파괴로 나타났다 이렇게 생각을 하고 지금 뭐 이미, 이미, 이미 늦었다면 시급한 일 After the film afterwards, does it get used, or does it go on to it goes on to the Brooklyn um, uh, shelf somewhere? <laughs> <laughs> As a friend, I well, I can say I just support what he's doing now. But the topic is, well, to be honest with you, the topic is just weird. I think it's a really a good topic to bring up.